Hey, it's Willie Crawford here, and uh, I'm up in the middle of the night like a lot of online marketers are, uh, and I thought I'd make a recording for you. The reason I'm up in the middle of the night is because during the day, I spend too much time uh, chit-chatting on Facebook, and, and then I get uh, calls from uh, all kinds of people, and then there's family things. Uh, so uh, I work a lot of times late at night making recordings or working on projects. I thought I'd t talk to you tonight for like a few minutes about what it actually takes to make more affiliate sales. Um, I've been a, a marketer, an online marketer since 1996, and most of that time I've sold affiliate products primarily, although starting in 2000 I created my own first product, and uh, now I have a complete line of my own products, and uh, I actually consider myself at age 61 semi-retired. Uh, but every day I deal with uh, aspiring business people. Uh, today I did a talk with a bunch of uh, high school students actually who are going through a, a summer camp at their church and they're exploring building websites and going into business for themselves. So I talked to them for an hour over Zoom, I'm sorry, over a Microsoft platform. Anyway, um, I, I recently won a, a, an affiliate sales contest uh, and uh, I, I thought to myself, you know, this is for me fairly easy now. And, and yet I know for a lot of people, I watch people who tell me day after day, they send out emails and they promote on social media. Some of them buy solo ads, they buy Facebook ads or whatever, and they're not making sales. They show me their stats, you know, and uh, they ask me, so what am I doing wrong? Uh, so I thought I'd tell you my secret for making more sales. Okay, secret number one is you should never, ever, 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 ever uh, promote something to your customers or your subscribers or your followers that you haven't actually looked at. Uh, me, as an affiliate marketer, if I'm promoting something like a piece of software or a course, I will, uh, I'll get a copy of that course before I even consider promoting it. And the way I do that typically is uh, I will reach out to the product owner if I know them, or even if I don't know them, and I say, I'll ask them for review access to the product. So I don't always pay for the product. Sometimes I do, because if I don't know the person, I want to see their customer service process and their delivery process, too. I want to make sure I know how my customers are going to be handled. But a lot of times, I'll request a free review copy when you become an affiliate marketer. And if you are effective, if you can make sales for the product owner, there's no reason for them not to give you a review copy when all they're giving you usually is access to a bunch of electrons. And if you're an affiliate marketer who's going to promote their product, you're probably not their ideal customer anyway. So why wouldn't they give you a review copy? And instead of losing that one sale to you, maybe they make you know, 10, 20, 50, 100, 500 sales. So people do give me review copies, okay? So one, you get a copy of the product and you actually look at the product, you test it. You know, if it's a, a, a course, you go through the course, you ask yourself, you know, is what's being taught in this course a bunch of BS, you know, it's a bunch of theory or will it actually work? And, you know, because there are a lot of people out there selling products that are theory, right? We, when I came online, there was the, you, you said to yourself, I'm brand new, you know, I, I how could I, create a product teaches them on something when I haven't done it? Well, the answer there is, if you want to create your own product and you haven't done it, then you need to find someone who has done it and you interview them and you become the reporter rather than someone who says, look what I've done. Instead, you say, look at how it's done and you share how someone else does it. That's how you do it if you haven't actually done it yourself. That's how you make a product and how to do it. Uh, but uh, the, the, so you want to know that the product is accurate, that it works. And uh, if it's a piece of software, you want to test it. And and once you're happy that it works, I, I read through the sales page very close. I want to know exactly what my customer is getting. I also want to make sure that it's clear what the customer is getting. Some sales pages are so confusing, you know, that I read it and I don't know what the page is selling. And if I if I can't make it out, excuse me, I'm going to drink a cup of coffee, a sip of coffee. And I did that because my throat was getting a little scratchy. You know, and that's another tip. Making videos, uh, keep a glass of lemon water handy. That'll soothe your throat if you tend to get a scratchy throat. But uh, So get a copy of the product. Look at it. Make sure it's accurate. Make sure it's going to deliver results for your customers because if you burn your customers once, you, you've lost that customer probably for life. And, you know, don't go for a quick buck and, you know, ruin your reputation and ruin a relationship with that customer because in 
affiliate marketing and online marketing and business in general, it's, it's about the relationships, customers, people, buy from people they know, like, and trust. And the trust you earn, the, the like, some people will like you, some won't, but as they get to know you, even if they don't like you, they'll buy from you sometimes because they know that you're a straight shooter and, you t and you're looking out for their best interest. You know, so like it, it, people, people like people for various reasons. So don't worry about that. And some of us even worry about how we look, you know, we're vain or self-conscious. And so we, we're afraid to get in front of a, a camera and make videos. I'm sitting in front of bright lights that show my wrinkles and the bags under my eyes because I'm getting old and my gray hair. Who cares? I'm here to tell you how to make more affiliate sales. And uh, so I've started with get a copy of the product, make sure the product works. Um, I make sure I trust the uh, product uh, producer. I make sure I trust their delivery process. Uh, in some platforms, there's leakage where you can make a recommendation for a product. And uh, if that product, um, if they make a sale that product, you don't always get credit for it. There's some sales that go through and for whatever reason the systems doesn't track it. It's not 100%. Uh, and a lot of them use cookies. And with cookies, a piece of computer code is dropped on the user's computer when they first visit the site. If they leave and they come back later, maybe typing it in directly, maybe they erase the cookies, uh, then you as a referrer aren't going to get credit for that sale uh, you know, un unless there's a secondary method of tracking it. Like some uh, affiliate, uh, some product owners will uh, ask the people for an email address or something to even review the product or look at it and that tags them in their database as that tags that potential customer in their database as your referral so I, I sort of like that system but the way that I handle that is I ask my customers I said make sure you're using my link and the way I do that is um, I, I, I give them the link but like I'm going to show you a product in a second and I want you to take a look at it and get okay uh, that's another thing. You have to ask for the sale. I'm going to ask you to get this product. And so I'm going to send you to a URL that is talkdirectlytocustomers.com. That's talkdirectlytocustomers.com. Now, what that is, is that is a, uh, a redirect link. I went out and I spent uh, eight and a half dollars on a URL, a domain name, and then I uh, went to my registrar and set up a 302 temporary redirect. Uh, I could have done a 301 permanent redirect. Uh, and um, so now when somebody types in talk directly to customers.com, they will go to my affiliate link instead of some website I've built. I have not built a website by that name. In fact, I plan on probably selling this URL after I've finished using it. I have literally <laughs> well over a thousand uh, domain names that I don't plan on keeping. Uh, and I have a lot of others that I use for things like websites that I get ranked in search engines and then rent and some I sell affiliate products from, but that's a, another discussion. Okay, so you, you find this product that you really like and you tested it out and now you want to tell your customers about it. The One of the battles you'll face if there's a product launch or even just a lot of people promoting the product is, a lot of people have your customers on their list and they're reaching out to the saying, buy this product. So your customer says, well, I can get it from Joe or Bob or Sue or Billy, you know, so uh, who do I get it from? And, and they're going to think, well, some people are offering bonuses. And they think, well, who offers the best bonus? And, see, and that's going to be your key in a lot of cases to uh, making the most sales. Uh, because if the product is the same no matter who they get it from, the basic product, then uh, it's a commodity. And, and so you, in order to not be a commodity, you need to offer a unique bonus. And so you ask me how to come up with a bonus. Uh, I can recommend uh, sites that, I, I'm a member of one site that has like, I have access to about 40,000 products via that site. And uh, a lot of them are products with resale rights, various types of resale rights to include Licenses that say I can give the product away as a bonus when someone buys another product. I have a lot of private label rights products that I can take, make my own by making minor changes to them, and I can I could bundle that and offer it as a uh, a bonus. But my preferred bonus is something totally unique, something that no one else has. And so, for example, I'm going to show you this product here that's called TalkDirectlyToCustomers.com. That, that talk about the customers.com is the URL I'm sending you to. The product is a product. Uh, let me find the product. 
I need to, what do I do? I need to share my screen. You, you need to know how to use your system to your, your recording platform. So I'm going to find my browser, share my screen, and then go to the page I want to show you. Okay, this page you're looking at right here is a product by my friend, Walt uh, Bayless, who's over in Australia. And uh, it's a piece of software. And what the software does is it personalizes the experience for visitors to a web page. And the way it does that is, if you're familiar with PERLs, PERL stands for personalized URLs. Um, and uh, some autoresponder systems will let you uh, grab a, a database. And when you do a broadcast, you can append certain things to the end of the URL. And that will identify who the visitor is when they land on the web page. Well, Walt software does something similar, but it, it to me is much easier to use. It is very simple to use and it's very powerful. But what happens is when somebody, when you install this uh, piece of software on your server, and then when somebody visits your web page, whether the web page is a blog page or a regular web page, it doesn't have to be just on a blog or a WordPress install. Uh, when someone hits that web page, uh, the page addresses them uh, in a personalized fashion. You know, hi, Joe, what's the weather like in St. Louis, whatever. Depends on what data pieces you've fed to the software. Uh, and you can use, you can uh, pull, you can use it for your subscriber base. You can also use it for contacts you pulled off of, off of like Facebook. It's designed to work with people who opt in to receive more information via Facebook, for example. So it's a very good piece of software. It's, it's inexpensive. Uh, Wall has two versions. Uh, I want you to go and read the page. I don't want to tell you everything about the software. I have the software. I've gone through its tutorials. I've looked at the software. I've played with it. I am going to be using it a lot, um, but I haven't uh, set up all my websites for it yet, all my lists for it yet. I have a lot of lists. I have a database of an insane database, let's put it that way. I'm, I'm in the uh, internet marketing niche. I'm in the health and fitness niche. I'm in uh, essential oils. I'm in the cooking niche where I've been selling a cookbook since 2000. Uh, and so uh, same cookbook. And so uh, I have a, a lot of databases that I need to shift over and put the software on. But I also want to show you what's the price. It's a no-brainer, complete no-brainer. Where is the price, Walt? You have two options. Here's my buddy, Walt. Uh, you have two options. So uh, he, he's going to throw in a free commercial license, first of all, which means when you build uh, websites for clients or whatever, you can uh, use the software on your client sites. That's the way I read that, that, that license. Uh, but where are my options? There's, there's two options. One, one option lets you use the software on, there we go. One option lets you use it on just five uh, of your pages. And that's the $21 option. So it's a no-brainer to go for another $6 and be able to use the web, the software on an unlimited number of sites and pages, and you get the commercial license. So, you know, it's like five pages or an unlimited number of sites and pages. And the software is very, very powerful. You know, Walt, uh, he covers everything. He has a demo video up top that shows how the software works and all that. So I'm going to ask you to go to talk directly to customers.com and check out the software. But because I'm teaching you how to make more affiliate sales and telling you, in fact, that I've already won in the last week, uh, post number one in, in one competition. Um, I know what I'm doing and I told you, you need to offer a bonus. So you say, okay, well, you know, don't just talk the talk, uh, walk the walk. And so what's your bonus for this? Well, my bonus is, I've been an affiliate marketer since 1996. When I first started, I first thing I sold was affiliate products. I had none of my own. And uh, I, over the years, learned what works and what doesn't work. And I've kept up with the changes in technology. And I've, I've studied, uh, you know, persuasion and copywriting and psychology and everything to do with sales. And I, I know I'm a very effective affiliate marketer, okay? And so I put together my affiliate training center. And my affiliate training center is everything that I know about affiliate marketing. It's modules, it's videos, it's audios, it's PDFs. Uh, 
everything that I know about affiliate marketing, about generating traffic, about building lists, about increasing conversions, about you know, you know building review blogs, everything I know about affiliate marketing is inside my affiliate training center. And not only everything I know, but things that I've learned from my mentors and from a lot of my contemporaries. I, if I have somebody who is a friend and they're very, very good at affiliate marketing, I'm not uh, stupid or, or egotistical enough to think that I'm the only one who knows how to market products uh, you know, as an affiliate. I'm not the only one. You know, I, I, there are people who do, who on a single affiliate promotion will do $100,000 in sales. And, and so I learn from people like that. And so inside my affiliate training center, I have a lot of products that I bought resale rights to. You know, somebody will say, I have a, a course I'm rolling out for, you know, four ninety seven, dollars but I'm selling a resale license to it too. I buy those licenses. So in my affiliate training center, I have my training, but I also have their training. And I know some people, when they first start out as affiliate marketers, they are on a shoestring budget. So they want to know, how do I market as an affiliate without spending any money. I don't have money for pay-per-click ads or to buy solo ads. I don't have money for even an autoresponder system or web hosting or all those tools that I think you need, I know you need to um, be an effective, super effective affiliate marketer. So I have training that will is designed for you regardless of the level you're at. Whether you're brand new and have no money and you think, how do I get started for nothing? My simple answer is uh, get a free account at AWeber that'll let you build a list of up to 500 and use social media and a lot of other things I teach you to drive traffic to an offer. And you're building a list and you could build a website on some free host, uh, something like even a blogger uh, where they will let you build a free blog, although their terms of service used to say you couldn't build for profit. Uh, websites and a lot of other free solutions say you can't make money from using their free solution, but a website not that way. And a lot of sites don't care, but you could also just build a, a uh, Facebook page or a Facebook group. And in that page or that group, you could target people who are interested in your specific niche. For example, I have a Facebook page that is just on uh, herbal remedies and essential oils. I sell essential oils. I have a link off of my page and a button at the top of my page where people can go to uh, my uh, site that sells essential oils. So I don't have a website on essential oils. I, I could, but I don't need one. I, I'm on Facebook, which has uh, one out of every seven people in the world. You have seven and a half billion people in the world, so you've got over a billion people on Facebook. And my page is optimized for people who are looking for essential oils or herbal remedies to find me. And to grow that page, the biggest thing I do is I invite people to like the page. And there are lots of likes to that page. And every time I make a post, people who like the page get a notification via the back end of Facebook saying, well, he's updated his page on essential oils and herbal remedies. And they go over and they look. And sometimes I'll recommend a specific product that I'm selling. It can be that simple. So for free, you've got a traffic source, which is Facebook. And you've got a, a place to host your list. So I teach stuff like that in my course, but I recommend, of course, that you build your own website and that you get a bigger, more powerful account. A Weber has a, accounts that can do all kinds of magic, and I teach within the course how to do that too. I, I, I within my affiliate training, I am still actually adding to it because every time I learn something new. You know, I think why not give it to people that I, I'm telling I'm going to make you a, a successful affiliate. So, you know, if I find a tool or a tactic or a technique or some code that you can just add to a web page that does something uh, that increases your search engine ranking or boosts your conversion rates or whatever, I'm going to tell you about it in the Affiliate Training Center. Now, the Affiliate Training Center, uh, I am charging for people who are not buying my custom, buying, buying products I recommend where I offer the Affiliate Training Center as a bonus. I'm charging $197 one time, $197 for lifetime access to my affiliate training center. That is my lifetime, not yours, because you may outlive me. Uh, but uh, it's $197 a one time, and that's for lifetime access to everything you want to know about affiliate training. And again, I am a very successful affiliate marketer. I lately focus more on 
promoting my own products and services. In fact, I focus mostly on promoting uh, my own training on how to build rank and rent websites. And uh, that's really all I promote. Uh, other than a, every now and then, some affiliate product really grabs my attention. And I try not to promote more than a, one or two a month. But I have friends who show me really, really neat stuff. Like Walt showed me this product. And I, uh, I know Walt, I use a lot of his stuff. Um, and uh, I know it works. He's, uh, he's, you, you got a lot of people who develop software, and the problem with developing software and rolling it out is that anybody can find a programmer in wherever and uh, get them to write a program, and they roll it out as maybe a warrior special offer or something, and, and then they go off and do their next project, and they don't support the software. Well, see, Walt is a serious business person who will and has upgraded and continuously, you know, taking care of every piece of software I've ever seen him release. And so that's, that's, that's huge, you know. Yeah, you can buy up any piece of software that probably does something similar to this, maybe. But if the person is not supporting it, they don't have a tech support team and, um, you know, a support desk and, and in-depth training on how to use the product, how to leverage the product, then uh, you're not really getting your money's worth there. And the product's eventually going to, stop working and the person's off doing something else. So that's why I'm rec that's why I don't hesitate to recommend Walt's products. Walt backs his products. Okay. So I want you to go ahead and take a look at talk direct with two customers.com. Get this software. This software will increase your conversions as an affiliate. I've already told you that you want to make sure when you're an affiliate that you pick only products you really believe in. You need to review the product and then you need to you need to build a list. Uh, but you can, before you build that list, drive traffic from social media, and I share how to do that in my affiliate training center. Uh, see, what else do you need to, be, to do as, a, as a, a successful affiliate? One of the things you need to do is be willing to actually use the products that you purchase. You know, uh, people, they're, they're always criticizing the what they sometimes refer to as the gurus, the people who are making big money off of selling picks and shovels to you uh, and they they say well they're selling all this stuff and they make that money from selling all this stuff uh, and yet I, I'm not making any money. Well, the reason that the majority of marketers I've studied, uh, observed, coached, mentored, looked at their problems, the reason they're not making money is because they buy all these bells and whistles, but they never use them. I, I don't care what you do online as far as a business. Somebody has to do the work and you can't just buy some piece of software and expect it to do everything for you. You have to, with this piece of software, you need to install it. And you need to probably want to watch, you do want to watch the tutorials on how to use it. There, there's extra bonuses there that tell you how to get the most out of the software and how to get the most out of your marketing in general. But that, that's going to do you no good unless you use it. So the, one of the biggest differences between me and many other marketers is that I actually go through the training you know, I, I'll get a product and I will set aside, I don't know, 10 hours to sit down and actually go through every video in the training if I need to. And, and I've done that. Some of them I go through three or four times because after that, I know all the nuances, at nuances and I know how to get the most out of that piece of software. And now I'm benefiting from having bought it because I use it, because I know how to use it. If you, a lot of people buy stuff that uh, sounds like it's, you know, the biggest news and they never learn how to use it. And eventually they just ignore it because it's too much trouble. Well, it's not too much trouble. They didn't put in the effort to learn to use it. If they use it, the stuff that the big dogs put together, most of it works. The stuff that doesn't work, ask for your money back and they won't last in business long anyway. I haven't lasted in business for 24 years online by selling products that don't work, okay? But you have to do the work. You have to use the product, but if you use the product, it will work. And so you, you another one of the biggest difference between successful affiliate marketers and unsuccessful affiliate marketer is a successful affiliate marketer is willing to do a little more. Uh, you, you read about a, a product that's about to launch and you, as an affiliate, you go out and you grab your affiliate link and you look, you grab the swipe copy, that copy that the marketer, the product uh, creator provides you as, 
sample copy and they say don't use it by word for word you know uh, put it in your own words but this is the basic description of what the product can do for your customer and all that so they give you something to work from don't use that swipe copy word for word go ahead and rewrite it in your own words put your own dna into it and put together a bonus and set up a system and that takes that takes effort don't offer some piece of crap for a bonus offer something that has real value the reason I'm offering access to my affiliate trading uh, center, a 197 value, that's the, the price I charge for it. The reason I am offering that to people who buy the software is I'm selling it hopefully to mostly people who sell goods and services. A lot of them are affiliate marketers and they want to increase their conversions. So I need to teach them how to be effective marketers, uh, more effective marketers. This one piece of software by itself will help a lot but it's not going to turn you into, you know, Merlin overnight. You have to know other things. You know, you have to know how to build a list and how to attract customers, how to uh, bond with them, build that relationship with customers, how to get them coming back. Uh, your typical product that you offer for sale, uh, your, your average customer is not going to buy it the first time you look at the product. They need to be reminded of that product several times in the, the world of, sales in general, direct sales, uh, they teach good salespeople learn that you need to touch a customer on average of about seven times, seven to 12 times before they, they buy. The first couple of times they hear about your product, and this is, you know, not doing one of these big launches, but in general, the first time they hear about your product, they're not really listening. They, they have so many other things hitting them, you know, and then it gradually after they hear about it over and over and over again, it sort of settles into their subconscious mind, and then at some point they take a look at it and think, well, maybe this might help me. And then after the fifth or sixth or seventh time, they think, let me look at it. And that's the hardest part of being an affiliate marketer is actually getting somebody to look at your product. And that takes work. So, you know, being a successful affiliate marketer means you can't be lazy, but I will teach you things that make you less, that, that require less work. So go ahead and go over to talk directly to customers.com read Walt's page very thoroughly and then scroll down to the bottom and click on the link that is my that link my affiliate link is encoded in this page provided you go through the link that i give you and the cookies i'll get credit for the sale and because i get credit for the sale i will give you free access to my affiliate training center uh, i'll ask you to forward your, your receipt or your proof of purchase to me um, that's the easiest way for me to do that, uh, at this quickest way for me to do that since I'm making the video and I haven't, uh, hadn't really thought of it another way to do it. Just email me, uh, Willie at WillieCrawford.org. It's Willie at WillieCrawford.org and, uh, just forward your receipt to me and I'll get you, I'll set up for lifetime access to my affiliate training center. I thank you for listening to my, uh, my rambling. I hope that you gained something from this actually. And if, and in fact, if you did, uh, I'll, uh, ask you to even share this video with others that are affiliate marketers who might benefit from learning how to make more sales. Again, I routinely win affiliate sales contests when I want to. And the reason I do is because I put in a little more effort than most. And I, I plan, I don't wait to the last minute to promote products. You know, some, if you ask me if you're launching a product, hey Willie, uh, can you promote my product? It, it launches tomorrow. I'm going to say no. Um, because I don't have time to fit it into my flow and, and to plan it, properly plan, and to even really, really look at your product, you know. So uh, I'll say no, and, and I encourage you to do the same thing. This is Willie. I'm, I apologize for rambling so much. It's late, and I'm getting ready to go to sleep, uh, even I'm drinking coffee for some reason. Um, so take a look at the software. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.